So if we move on now to look at an example with cubics, so using the equation y equals x cubed minus 2x squared, draw a table of coordinates from x equals minus 1 to x equals 3. Uh, use the values to plot the graph between these x values. Okay, well, we've got our table already. Uh, so now we just need to plug in these values for x. So I'll do the first one. Uh, so if I just remove that equation. So the equation now is x cubed minus 2x squared. Uh, so let's use our brackets again because I think that makes it clear. The first value is minus 1. So I'll be minus 1 and then use this button here uh, to get the uh, power and then you just type in the power that you want so in this case we want 3 and then it's minus 2 times uh, and then it's x squared so again it'll be minus 1 and then we just use the square button uh, so that's our first one that gives us a value of minus 3 so I won't make you watch me put the other ones into the calculator I'll get back to you when I've done all of those so if you complete the table, it should look like this. So you have minus 1, minus 3, 0, 0, 1, minus 1, 2, 0, and 3, 9. Uh, so I've done all that off camera there, but you just use the same process as before. Uh, so let's plot these points then. So the first one is minus 1, minus 3. That's down there. Then we have 0, 0, which is the origin there. We have 1, negative 1, which is there. 2, 0, which is here. And 3, 9, which is all the way up here. And the final thing to do then is just to join all of these points up with a smooth curve. So if you do that, it should hopefully look very neat. And it should look something like this. Uh, so we have two turning points here. Uh, we have a maximum and a minimum. And the curve is smooth. Again, I've not used a ruler or anything. You just have to draw it freehand. Try and make it as neat as possible. If you'd like to get some more practice with this topic, you can take our online exam. It's available through our revision platform. Uh, if you go to the test, you'll find loads of different questions, a variety of different question types, and you get instant feedback on each and every one of them. Uh, so if you're interested, then click the link below and it will take you straight there.